Me and Offset, we was not seeing eye to eye. This was like the same year that I filed for divorce and everything. I'm gonna let him talk about mm. this because I'm, I'm gonna let him talk about this because what was one of the main thing that was really bothering me. Don't say it because I want him to say that. I'm gonna let him say it himself. Yeah. The main thing that was really bothering me. And y'all are gonna be mad that I just stopped right <laughs> now, but I, I because. I want him to say it. Yeah, I want him to say it because I feel like that's really part of his story, like his story. Mm -hmm. The main thing that that I wanted him to stop and everything, he stopped and he changed and it showed me that he wanted a change from he me. He fought for his family. Less than six months after that Jason Lee interview where Cardi B declared that her relationship with Offset was healthier than ever, Offset is once again in the news shaming Cardi B with rumors of his infidelity. Many claim that Offset has never truly stopped cheating on Cardi B since their relationship began and that this isn't anything new. Let's review how this toxic union started and why Cardi B is never leaving Offset no matter how many times he cheats. Their first official date was going to the Super Bowl in 2017 in which Offset described on The Tonight Show as being, my first date, I went big. You get what I'm saying? I wanted to do something that was unusual. I took her to the Super Bowl because I wanted to have fun. Cardi B told GQ, listen, if we're going on a public date, you cannot make me seem like a fool after this. I contacted my publicist to warn him because I was really timid. He responded, no, I truly like her. I'm feeling her a lot. As expected, given the couple's respective positions of power, things got really serious following their date to the Super Bowl. She stated in the same interview that it got really serious after the Super Bowl because I feel like all eyes were on us. After the Super Bowl date, Cardi B and Offset were seen together at the Met Gala after party in May of 2017. By then, the rumors of them dating had started to circulate and there was no denying it. After dropping the music video for Lick featuring Offset, the fans were convinced that they were a couple as they teased a kiss at the end of the video. The video was hot and everyone was talking about the new rap power couple. Later that year, in 2017, in the middle of a Power 99's powerhouse concert in Philadelphia, Offset dropped on one knee and proposed to Cardi in front of the crowd, and of course she said yes. We did find out later, however, that the couple had actually already been married in a private wedding that they did in their hotel room. Following the unexpected proposal, Cardi B posted on Instagram, I can't wait to spend forever with you. Let's love and make lots of money together. Then their luck changed. A few months after Offset proposed, he was at the center of a cheating scandal when videos of the rapper with various women in bed were leaked. When asked about the scandal publicly, Offset told one reporter that it's my real life and declined to address the charges in his Rolling Stone interview. He said, it's not a gig. You understand what I'm saying when I say it's not a game? Cardi B, on the other hand, was not as hesitant to talk about it. She took a much more direct approach by tweeting her thoughts on the matter. No, it's not right for an end to cheat. But what you want me to do, she wrote. Go F another end, start all over again, and get cheated on again? This it happens to everyone, and I bet it happens to you too. People handle their relationship different, so? And it's this statement as to why I believe Cardi B will never really take any action and leave Offset. She believes that whoever you're with, you're probably going to get cheated on. Also, the Bodak Yellow hitmaker opened up about her fiance's alleged infidelity in a February 2018 interview with Cosmopolitan. I know I look good. I know I'm rich. I know I'm talented, she began. I know I could get any man I want, any basketball player, football player, but I want to work out my ish with my man, and I don't got to explain why. The native of New York also complained how closely her personal life was being covered by the media. She told the magazine, I'm not your property. This is how I live. I'm going to think it over carefully before making a choice. People don't know what I did because I'm not an angel, but what he did was wrong. By the summer of 2018, Cardi B and Offset were back on good terms. They did a pregnancy layout in Rolling Stone magazine where Offset kissed her belly for the Rolling Stones June cover. It would be Cardi B's first child while Offset was on baby number four, which he had from other relationships. Although it was baby number four for Offset, it was still exciting because it was their first child together. Cardi B was aware of some of the stuff that people were saying in the background. P 
People want to make fun of me saying I'm the fourth baby mom, but I know I'm not having a baby with a shit ass man. Offset's reference to Cardi B as his wife at the BET Awards in June of 2018 sparked utter social media uproar when they announced they were beginning a family. The couple's marriage certificate was obtained by TMC hours later and revealed that they had already been married on September 20, 2017 in Atlanta. Some fans, as I stated earlier, were disappointed and called Cardi and Offset out for staging the fake proposal in Philly when they were already married. A house built on a web of lies, some claim. Cardi confirmed the news on Twitter after being hesitant to divulge anything about the married couple special day. We decided to be married one morning in September. I said I'd do without a dress, without make, and without a ring. At least you can stop claiming I had an unmarried child. I think she needs a child out of wedding. Culture, Cardi and Offset's first child together was born in July of 2018. Despite the birth of their child and Cardi B's lavish birthday celebration that she and Offset had just celebrated, Cardi revealed that she still intended to divorce Offset in December of 2018. Her public statement, although we genuinely care for one another, our relationship hasn't been successful for a while. We just seem to have fallen out of love and therefore we are no longer together. The divorce could take some time, but I will always adore him because he is the father of my kid. But there's always a twist with those two. The couple decided to attempt to repair their relationship after that breakup and they reconnected in January of 2019. Offset proceeded to shower Cardi with presents on Valentine's Day and Mother's Day, giving the impression that their relationship was on the men. Then on September 15, 2020, three years into the marriage, Cardi B allegedly filed for divorce yet again in Atlanta after learning that Offset had cheated yet again. The question of the day was, is he ever faithful? Then on October 10, 2020, during Cardi B's birthday celebration, the couple was seen kissing only a few weeks after she had filed for a divorce. Then on October 15, she came on Twitter and decided to explain why people had seen her and Offset back together again. You can't help but to talk to your best friend. You understand what I mean? It's difficult to avoid talking to the person you're closest to and not having any D is incredibly hard. No pun intended. Cardi B dropped the divorce in November 2020, indicating the pair had reconciled. Two months later, the case was dismissed in Fulton County without prejudice. Then, September 4th, 2021, Cardi B and Offset welcomed their new baby boy, Wade. Again, the latter part of 2021, their smooth sailing with Cardi B and Offset. In a statement given to people, the couple stated, we are so overjoyed to finally meet our son. We are eager for him to meet his other siblings because he is already so adored by family and friends. On December 13, 2021, Offset turned 30, in which Cardi B gave him $2 million for his birthday. To commemorate the event, Cardi posted a number of throwback images and videos of the duo on Instagram. She congratulated him for being a devoted husband and father in the caption. She began the message by wishing her husband, best friend, and child's father a happy birthday. I adore you a lot and am quite proud of you. Together we have accomplished so much. I adore the father you are, the guy you're growing into. I want to thank you for always being there for me, for being an excellent confidant and guide, and for never letting me undersell myself. So, after seeing all these ups and downs that they've been through in the last few years, with the new allegations of cheating surrounding Offset, do you really believe that they're true, number one? And do you think Cardi B will finally really divorce him? Leave your comments below, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.